week later, Jane Adams comes back into the restaurant, finds her server, and gives him a tip. The server says, you didn't need to do that. I, you know, that's okay. Thanks. And she goes, no, apparently I did, because I've been reading it all over the internet that I didn't give you a tip. <laughs> so the, the waiter kind of sheepishly apologizes, but you know, doesn't know how in the world his tweet got picked up by Variety and every online blog. Uh, so what do you think, fired or not fired? Totally fired. <laughs> well, no, we're like, asking this whether he got fired. Yeah. Oh, yeah, he got fired. Yeah. He been. Oh, yeah, I agree. But this is, so, so the, the rules of the game are, did the person actually get fired or not? Some things will be easier than that. Right. So this was a CNN editor. Some of you guys may have heard of this one. Uh, CNN editor Octavia Sear tweeted that uh, after a Lebanese cleric had died, he was one of Hezbollah's giants I respect a lot. So the interesting wrinkle here is, this is a media organization. They're supposed to be out talking and writing and uh, you know voicing opinion. But what do you think? Is she fired or not fired? Fired. Everyone's got a vote. Sorry, we're a small group. Fired. Fired. Absolutely fired. It's a fun one. <laughs> so apparently, it's a Pittsburgh Pirates games, which I think nine people go to. Uh, <laughs> They have these guys that run around uh, during the innings, and they say, Baby Smith, they, they race. And so one of these one of these guys was just a kid, you know, a college-age kid, uh, and Coonley, who owns the team, extended the contracts to the manager and the GM. And he didn't like that. I mean, the Pirates, if anyone follows baseball, up until this year have been just devastatingly, devastatingly.